Beautiful darlings, it's good to see you. And we're deeply relieved to let you know that it is Monday. And therefore, time for an episode of Mostly Walking. I'm Sean Hell Bob. Yeah. Mm. And I'm Finger Guns McGrainer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Lee Grainer. I'm Lee Grainer, and you need to go to LeeGrainer.com. Yes. And I am, I'm Sean Bouchard. And we would like to warmly welcome you back to potentially the final episode of Bone Totaming, but knowing us, we're probably only halfway done with the game. Uh -huh, um, uh -huh. And we're, we're going to jump into this one pretty quick um, yeah, because I just want to play the game. Yeah. And the last thing that we encountered was a submarine full of, uh, I believe it was like 1980s um, Russian seamen. And no, I think yeah, that's I, accurate. I, I said that, and then I immediately was like, YouTube, C, men. men, as in men from the Do you understand? YouTube? YouTube, the transcription the is just like, don't worry, I've got it. Don't run ads for this guy. <sighs> and so we're you sitting can here. Sell this. Oh, go on. Yeah, we're sitting here with like a bunch of stuff, and mm. our, our basic task that we have for Moe's appears to be that we want to get into this, there's like, oh, not this way. No, I just went from there. Like there's a there's a nuclear bomb that is locked away over here and we need some way to like put radiation on the outside and then it will loosen up or something like this. Huh. You guys remember this? Oh, I remember. Gotta remember. loosen that bomb. Because yeah, it was one of these things where, like, th there's the kind of puzzle where it's like, you need to break into this door. Um, because, no, 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 don't go there. Ah, what a nightmare. Um, there's the kind of puzzle where it's like, you need to uh, break into this room, and there's a door that's locked, and you need to solve a puzzle to open it. But this is just like, quickly, you need to irradiate the outside of the door to make sure right. that it doesn't right, right, think right, right, right. that it's preventing radiation leaks. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, the possibility of a hull breach or to still be deployed unless radioactive materials are detected in the torpedo. Yeah. So we need to get radioactive materials here, yeah? I think there that's are no right. no radioactive materials <clears throat> in the torpedo room. <laughs> yes. One of the rules that my mother always put down. So yeah. we have this torpedo. Tell me about it. It's got some colored symbols on it. That, yeah. that seems important. Okay. Okay. Can you just can you, can you just stick the grenade on there and sort of yeah, like call it a day? What do I? What do we have here? We have a mini sub stem. Oh, I'm remembering all the goofy components that we need to do. Okay, so. Yep. Most recently in the story, which it feels like we're in a bizarre temporary detour from. It does. In in the story, <clears throat> we've learned that Charlie is like trying to break into this facility as a member of like the Yellow Leaf, which is some sort of subversive organization that's against Kane Corp. Yeah. It seems so, although I wish there had been more kind of world building around that. Yeah. This is, this is having the classic adventure game starts so good, and then slowly you see budgetary constraints preventing yep. the skill of the developers from getting to fix the issues. Um, budgetary constraints and also just complexity, right? Like, I think the, the complexity of the game compounds as it goes forward, and it becomes harder and harder to keep up that level of quality, and then also pair that with budgetary constraints. You get in position. Oh, Makes I can actually. <gasps> can you get the? Do you have? Make sure oh shit! Dude, we did it. Damn. Great. More science stuff. <laughs> oh, I hate science stuff. Don't jinx it. Oh, what was that from? That was an old pull. I mean, can you match UAV those symbols? Does it does it have the same symbol set? Yes. Let's okay. See. Twelve plus. So do I need to get these to match? Yeah, I, I think 
I think you want the ones that are visible to match, and then we gotta figure out what's in the corrupted data. Bits. That is that is a brutal audio that is playing. Yeah. You mean the uh, the funky selection sound? <laughs> I don't know if you're going to brute force this one. The chances of you oh. brute forcing this are roughly 0 0.001758. Okay. Oh, I almost spilled my beers. But so, I didn't. Gosh, dude, Lee, you, you have unloaded an incredible memory right before we did this of metadata yeah. where we... Metadating. We had pitched mm -hmm. the show is that we will drink craft beers while we play the show. <laughs> yeah. Which is, it, that's that? a wild pitch. I, 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 well, actually, 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 I don't know that we did. Because I remember it as it said we were going to in the show tagline. And then <laughs> we bailed. I on recall that you, I think you didn't, as I recall, you didn't know wh where that came from. So I think. It was that metadating was like a sort of uh, a, another version of vaginal fantasy, which was Felicia's show where right. she would like read romance novels with her friends and talk about it. So that's why we would play oh, romantic like games and talk about like it. Vaginal fantasy. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> that's I, what, it was I, gonna be. We wanted it to be penal code. Yeah, we wanted to be penal code, oh, but, they, right. but they rejected that name because it was a little on the nose. Because <laughs> it's like codes in games, penal's a funny word. All right, done. Like we yeah. did it. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right. So, so the other thing that we need to do is we need to like reassemble this dude. But like, I, I don't think that there is anything at all to do. Like, literally, we need to... There's nothing left. There's nothing left for Charlie to do. Oh, wait. That's right. There is the duplication system. This is it. Like, we can't go in here unless something comes up. Do we have a hand? We have a saw without a blade. We have an open bear trap. We have an unconscious scrubber, beans, a live grenade, a dagger, a saw blade. Hmm. We have a wet, sharp inventory. <laughs> Coming in hot. Yeah. Well, I mean, we're still short on ship ribs. That is the one it's thing I'm worried about. Torpedo. That's true. You need a ship uh -huh. rib, baby, a ship rib. Well, wait a minute. What if we... We take a look at this. I'm, I'm trying to think if there's anything... With... Is that your driver's license for having a brain? Is this where stem? we found... What's his name? Yeah, Caliban. Caliban, the... <clears throat> Caliban. Caliban. The sentient AI who's just... He's so mad! The most mad AI. I don't think we had any notable Caliban stuff in here. This just looks like some, some bone totems that are in stasis. Yeah, you've got those locked down pretty hard. There's some nuts. And look at those guys, Crablars. Oh, dude, I love Crablar. Crablar's one of the greatest, mess, or greatest words of all time. <laughs> is Crablar just like a day nine thing? Crablar is the name of a hand in poker. It's King Three. Oh really? <laughs> and it, which is a terrible hand. <laughs> and for some reason it just has the name Crablar and it just it's a very fun thing to say, Crablar. And so Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm Amazing. I'm not messing around. And and um anytime I saw a crab, at any time in my life afterwards, I would say Crablar. And <laughs> Then we just made an emoji of that happy crab, which you can see in chat, and that's it. Like, that's the entire yeah. thing. That's really good. That's a very good meme. King like, 3 uh, you know is I mean. also known as the King Crab because the 3 resembles a crab or the Crablar. Sure. Yeah, the I, Crablar. That's what I said. I said that. <laughs> no, that's 100% what you said. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. insane. Wow. Yeah, I know, because it sounds I like guess, I'm lying. Yeah. Like, most of the time, yeah. it sounds like I'm lying. But half the <laughs> yeah, time, I'm course. telling the truth. You know what I like? And this this is this is the first time I've really been able to articulate this. Um, there's a thing when you're talking about, like, s symbology or occult stuff. 
um, where it's like, I guess also with that, where it's like the three resembles the Krablar. Just the idea that, I, I love that like when there's a symbol, they just call it the, like the Krablar. Um, yeah. I'm trying to think of another, it's kind of like, oh, I'm trying to think of another example, but it's like, ah, yes, These a clear example of the, the Petunatato. I wish I could hear the like sound they make. Polygon or something. Uh... Where it's like, you don't say that that's a Krablar, you say that that is the Krablar. <laughs> I have found, what is this? It's an archaeological uh, instance of the Krablar. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I see what you're talking about. It's, it's, it's like... Um, yeah, like, ah, there's got to be like a, a, a name for that in English teacher speak. Oh, were, um, were you just you just put the in front of it? Yeah, and you're like referring to like to like symbology specifically. Yeah, like instead of saying like it's a pentagon, you say like it's the pentagon. Like I, <laughs> Oh, look at I this. see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, you because because it's not it's not N L, it's the L. The right. L. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think Maybe it's any time you refer to a symbol as a whatever symbol. It's like, hmm, I've written the asterisk. <laughs> On this piece of paper, I, I have inscribed the asterisk. Okay, so Sean, only because you, like, did this. Yeah. And it didn't help. Yeah. I, I, think, I think go back to where we got Caliban's brain from. Okay. Calibrain. Yeah, because because right now I feel like there's about five different things we could be doing. This is one of them, going back to see what was in Caliban's holder. Um, another thing is trying to figure out this lock that I just hit the hint button for and heard Moe's say that we need to... It's like, I wish I could hear it. And I'm like, I can hear it. Like, I can literally just hear it. I'm a very wet There we go. No way. Stem memory. Enne Enneagram. Stemmogram. 329XXX. So we need probably one more. I need to... And I can brute yeah, force I that shit. I think you can brute force one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get it to 42069. Absolutely perfect. Also, I'm It's important I'm because that's the sex number as yes. well as the. Um, Smoke, smoke number. Wait, wait. Do, do you think there's also it's over here? I don't know. No, those are your library cards, remember? And the one on the left looks like a beaver looking into an X-ray. <laughs> <laughs> it's. I mean, that's that's incredible. Yeah, because you can see his little his little arms, and there's his oh eyes, and his nose. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. That's very good. He swam too greedily and too deep. All right, so we don't know these two. Hey, guys. Yeah. Mm. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Yeah. Welcome to Mackle Watch. It's a Twitch stream within a Twitch stream mm. where I talk about a joke that five, the six. McElroys have made. Um, I was listening to my brother, my brother, and me, and they had a really funny bit about where you should pee in the ocean without being Success. too close to either your family. Did you just fucking do that? Well, so it was all the numbers, numbers in the ocean. except oh, six and five. So, got Smartest it. Mark. So you I just put it six and five. Uh, okay, where should you pee in the ocean, Lee? They said find a whale, find your dad, and go uh, completely equidistant. Equidistant between a whale and your dad? Thanks. This has been Mackle Watch, a uh, Twitch stream within a Twitch stream where this I is... talk about a joke that the Mackle have made. 
This is great because like because like now I'm solving puzzles all over the place. You sound better. Like, yeah. How do you feel? Return me to the female. Just like that, huh? No thank you? No. Return me to the female. When is someone going to tell me what's going on? <laughs> what Please, the fuck? Mac, I'll explain, I promise. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Return me to the female. So... <laughs> you'll open the door now? Will you get on the floor? Wait. Will you Why? The dinosaur? of trust. Jesus. Oh, my it wants Why do good to... guys finish last? It wants me to incorporate it into my plug suit. It wants to attach itself to me. <laughs> this game is gonna keep going. Charlie, your plug suit is bonded to your nervous system. What the fuck. That basically means it's attaching itself to you. He's correct. I could have guessed. You will inherit a direct link to Caliban's cognitive and personality systems. But there are drawbacks. <laughs> but there I are know. drawbacks. Really? A physical stem bond will require a surgical procedure to remove. I what about know. a steam bond? No alternatives exist. I require a physical <laughs> bond. Integrate me. Charlie, no. <laughs> Don't do this. This is... I have to. I mean, I, I no. need to have Why? It. Yep, let's go. What, what is this all is about? happening? We can have the her The people back. of your plug suit Mac? are full of good Oh, people. come on. Her who? Oh, oh her really? Who? We can have what? her back. Huh? Oh. Dot, dot, dot. Hope is gone, Charlie. That was the deal I made with Yellow Leaf. Come here, oh, shit. find Caliban, bring it out, and we get her back. A and we also redeem the clone. soul of the Moe's. Is that oh, what we're yes. talking about? They have everything they need. DNA and genetic sequences from the day she died, which which gives them the algorithms they need to reproduce oh, the neuron yeah. patterns oh, of her dark. memories and personality. This won't go and wrong. It won't be her, Charlie. It will be a copy. I can see hope again. No, Bear. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> None of us can. Not in this way. I told you. You don't want to try this in this way. You were too far past it. You've moved on too much. I've moved on? Hope. Gross. But you'll see. That's like not what you want to be When saying. you hear her too, you'll see. I mean, this is kind of you'll interesting. You'll understand. Too. Yeah. Hear her too. Hear her. What is that? Somebody's been leaving you on. No is it? This I'm is, not talking to the guy that bought the play, Charlie. Oh. Wow. Get this man some Vespian gas. I have to. <laughs> I have to. The soup is so good. I mean, I just want to be really clear. The soup is really good. It's got carrots in it. It's got celery. Mm. Oh, that's all you bit. need. It kind of stinks, but... Yum. Wait, what stinks? What? <laughs> Alright, there we go. Caliban and a fresh scent. Ooh. She just downloaded it. What the fuck? I love that Newman is the same as the character in Seinfeld, the Jerry Seinfeld hater. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> that, that's Newman right there. I literally, I I forget that until you say it every single time. You've got to integrate me, Jerry. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Newman. Resource intelligence, Caliban Incorporated. Full access to suit systems granted. Oh, Kane. We are joined. You are honored. You are honored. Do you get the ramifications of this? There are only nine new men, Charlie. Nine AIs. To integrate with one. D9, TV. Be a better the gamer, of the Charlie. Church sacrifice themselves to do it. They give up everything. Willingly. They're the most important assets the corporation has, 
Every member of it will want us dead now. They'll come for us, no matter where we go, oh, no matter what back. deals you've made. It doesn't matter. It could not matter more. Yellow Leaf wants to use this AI Point to destroy Kane. <laughs> the data I possess, trillions of lines of code, of secrets. My betrayal will not go unpunished. Oh, you see, God, you afraid, have huh? just self-destructed our entire. What? <clears throat> okay. What? We're, um, recording. How are you feeling today? Huh. huh? This is a weird way to have a dramatic cutscene. You can talk to me, it's okay. Yeah. yeah. You're safe. Oh my yep, god. It's true. Can you tell me how you're feeling? Can you move around at all? Okay. Just yeah. okay. Whoa. Interesting. Oh. Okay. No. Alright. Well, okay isn't bad. It could be worse, couldn't it? <sighs> I'm scared. Oh, stop shit. it. I'm sure you are, sweetheart, but you're safe here. Nothing can hurt you. Can you tell me your name? Don't. Try and remember your... Hope. <laughs> That's wonderful. That's very good. <laughs> yes. Wonderful. Your name... Stop this! Batman! This is Matt. Hope. They sent me this recording. Proof of life. She's waiting, Mac. She's real. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's not a deep thing. Alive. If you would just listen to the entire. No. Never play that again. She got fished so hard. Mac. She got fished. That's fit. Never. See this guy. This guy knows. Right. This guy's cool. I'm on Team Zerg on this one. <laughs> Lee, you've been saying the same shit Caliban is saying for like four episodes. Like, <laughs> we should play Spaceship Warlock. Let's leave. Caliban <laughs> <laughs> desires. Oh my god. How are you feeling? Because I'm a potato. You found a collectible. Oh, nice. Great. Add that to your uh, Steam, whatever. in hell? That's the most adorable little avatar. <laughs> Water animal forever. <laughs> huh. Okay. Oh, yeah, look, it's Among Us. Um... It's a Mogus. Yeah, there's definitely a weird place for a Mayan calendarling, but okay. Well, let's let's take a peek at what we have. Is the do scepter? Do, 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 do. <laughs> do you have a scepter? Hmm. <laughs> there's another interactable thing, yeah, which I assume is a go down. All right. A go downer. Go downer. I hardly know her. <laughs> it's too many word associations with like immediately spring to mind. Wait, wait, I gotta go back up. Yep. Cause then you get where? Oh no, I see. So so this is the we walked over the top. <laughs> That's what those other blue lines are. So this is the mm. lower area. So we're walking underneath this. <gasps> oh <gasps> my. Well, all right, Mac. Zoom in. Look at this. I mean, I gotta that, say. Man? Are those drawn on? Skin. Yeah. They're tattoos. Pretty. As usual. Missing the point there. <sighs> They're like. hieroglyphs. Stories and images. Primitive culture. The translation was. Simplistic. What does it mean? Eastern Pacific region. Discord is all 2000 BC. 
death worshippers. Sacrifice. Cannibalism. A primitive culture. They are the seed and all. Are? Yes. I am afraid they are not extinct. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So, wait. Okay. So, wait. All right, we have Wilson here. My computer oh. cannot oh, handle this. Okay, thing. okay. Fuck. Oh my god, I've lost the ability to stop watching the stream. <laughs> that can't be good, right? Another. I, I gotta say. The most technological prowess was revered. They mastered the wheel before other pre Columbian cultures. Master builders. Wilson! Wealthy. Powerful, primitive, unremarkable. I mean, that, this that seems this remarkable. Whole, you, did, you did specifically remark upon their accomplishments. So. I, I really feel yeah. like we should absolutely hit Caliban with a gotcha. I don't think he's evolved enough to deal with my absolute pettiness. There you go. I have to say the... I like um, this one. Yeah, bear. Real neat. Except it's tattooed on flayed skin. I'm afraid so. The seed and all's island chains succumbs to cataclysmic tectonic activity. It sinks below the ocean. Oh my god, this is Indiana Jones and the fate of Atlantis. It's Atlantis. I guess this is it, right? We fucking got there. My coalition operates at an accuracy rating above 82% on average. Oh my god, sounds like my teammates in Dakota. I am a Whatever it predicts, you can trust. I'm mid or abandoned. Believe me, its cognitive I mean, ability is immeasurable. Accuracy. Yeah. Like, um, okay, the uh, voice act, the quality of the voice acting is incredible. That's what I was trying to say. It's true. Dude, yeah, across like, the board. Thank you. Case. Yeah. Yeah. No, a hundred percent. It's really impressive. That that is hard to do, especially for a game that plays with heightened emotions and melodramatic language the way that this game does um it is that it's it's not easy to maintain yeah. that kind of quality in voice acting yeah and and like one of the things that i think i didn't appreciate about almost any form of acting is when you watch a movie it feels like a continuous sequence of a beginning and a middle and an end in order but often when they shoot movies, it's completely out of order. You know? Yeah. Right. Yes. So it'll, be, it'll be like, okay, well, uh, this is the final climactic scene where your son, uh, who you reconciled with recently, is going to die now. So you really need to be upset. Uh, and you guys met 15 minutes ago. You ready to do the scene? You know, it's like, <laughs> it's so weird. Yeah, now. isn't that weird? And, isn't I mean, that weird? I, I think that, like, booth recording is especially weird because you're just saying shit alone in a booth where they're like all right sean uh you're gonna say this line what 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 are you doing here uh sean uh what the, the person is gonna say is i'm here to kill you and uh okay whenever you're ready what you're gonna fucking kill me and it's just like there's no interaction there's no context you're just like bam yeah. bam 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 doing lines and like yeah yeah, yeah. and then when all that's done the people making the game just have a bunch of recordings and if they're like ah, the emotion was a little off on this one well, sometimes that's the way it is. Like, <laughs> and dude, I, I like a good director in that situation is like worth their weight in gold to just like be able to track totally. what the fuck is happening. It's insane. Yeah, continuity. I mean, continuity is like such this a weird is, uh, art. How form. do you say their name? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can't overstate how this, Oh, were they a primitive they culture? I didn't get that before. But okay. Yeah, they're so how? primitive. How could they survive? How remarkable. Their pockets with their structures and geographical anomalies combined with the natural resistances of the society itself. 93% accuracy prediction. Food was it's... scarce, but a new option presented itself in the form of a mutation. Do I Man want beef. to know? They call it the Velas. Prior to the Cataclysm, it was 
a simple compost right. plant native to the island chain that specializes in the consumption and assimilation of organic matter through a unique protozoan infection model. 89% accuracy prediction. It found that its new high pressure, low light environment, the necessary components for mutation and evolution. Its growth, reproductive, and contaminant metrics all exponentially increased. The plant like contaminant we've seen. That's this? Um, Velus? 98% accuracy prediction. Insects nice. trapped in the sunken island chain responded to exposure with the bonus. Wait, how could you be 90% sure that the plant exists? That's their food source down here. 98% sure <laughs> Giant that insects. something specific is the plant. <laughs> how can you be, how can you know that I someone else's place. statement is 98% probably correct? Dude, I, no, like, like, I, I want to be, be honest. Um, any, all these numbers are incredibly bad. Like ninety three percent accuracy yeah. is fucking terrible accuracy. If it's like, hey, do you want to like uh, just take my car to the restaurant? I mean, there's a ninety three percent chance we'll make it. Like, you would you'd be crazy it, to get out of the car. I mean, it, it all depends on context. And like eighty six percent accuracy overall is incredible because I think this is an intelligence that's designed to do things like predict the stock market, right? Yeah. And if you if you could predict the stock market with eighty six percent accuracy, holy shit. Um, I like the idea of this super intelligence putting together profiles of like, I, I figured out what happened. I figured out what all of this means and where it comes from. And I, there is a, there's a metric by which I am, uh, sort of, you know, qualifying my, my intelligence or my interpretation of this, but the actual numbers are nonsensical dude no it's so i i just i just love it damn girl that ass is the most amazing i've ever seen 90 <laughs> accuracy <laughs> <laughs> i just want this in other context uh um can i just i'd like to just shout out the cool cute looking little guys on the screen there oh yeah you mean these, these guys like hello these little men yeah well, those little men. yeah i mean they're adorable i would play a platformer that uh that starred like two of them that stack on each other's heads. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Apparently, this ancient civilization, all their shit is really cute. Yeah. Each one of like these is more horrifying and stuff. cryptic than the last. <laughs> you hear that, Lee? It's actually horrifying and cryptic. So did the insect mutants. We have them now, a means of survival. The dotted lines are an anomaly here. What does that mean? It means Caliban was never able to conclusively determine the. I am uh, I am human. If I am not capable of formulating an answer, then no answer is capable of being. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah. We are Apologies. Newman. Yes, we am. We are Sensitive Newman. Sensitive little thing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm not a little thing. I'm not a little That's thing. Really I am good. Newman. Seriously. I'm Newman. You need to back off. 94% accuracy. <laughs> I love how he's also just... It's just him. You just gotta take his word for the accuracies. Yeah, no, that's... I mean, this 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 is like a terrible project manager. Like, this guy definitely had to lay off staff recently. This guy's, like, fucking terrible. Oh, yeah. He's so bad. God. This one... I do not like. For once, we agree. Important. Of? Why? The Ascension. That is their name for it. They return to the surface. A prophecy. A primitive culture. <laughs> You're saying what? They want to go back up? Topside? Topside. Their prophecy promises them a return to the surface. One out of fifty shot that they are trying to catch the game. They will take revenge on the old gods. Old gods? They have abandoned them. They have new gods now. New what man. the fuck does that mean? Language, Mac. It has not been proven conclusively, but there is evidence. Religious dogmatic influences. Iconography of a sort they should never have been aware of. Anachronistic religious influence. 68% accuracy prediction. <laughs> 
But okay. how is that possible? How's any of this possible? Hey chat, could you please start appending like the accuracy percentage of your, of your <laughs> message? <laughs> oh my god, yes. Oh my god, this is so good. I'm bringing this on screen. Potato spices, you miss every shot you don't take. 98% accuracy. <laughs> <laughs> that is, I mean, that was so fast. It took you like no seconds to figure that out. That was brilliant. That's amazing. <laughs> I, I, can, I can even hear his stupid growly voice, you know. Never pet a burning dog. 68% accuracy. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, oh. Sean, did you get never pet a burning dog? Did you get that from my old old Geo City? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Literally, are yes. you serious? Absolutely. Wait, I've been saying that for uh, years, and it is because of that Geo Cities that you showed me. Let's see. We're oh my god. Uh, yeah. So we are 2024. <laughs> we met in 2008. Rules. So yeah. Holy shit! It was, it was, uh, it was where an they, ancient meme. So. Where? Where are those Geo Cities? Where do they live now? They're like, Internet, where are they Internet preserved? Internet archive, maybe? Um, there was some <clears throat> particular place. Where is GeoCities preserved? Take a look. It's in a boat totem. <laughs> body. Dr. Laidlaw, it was less than useful. No efficiency impact as a result of her loss. Do you even care that these people are dead? Slaughtered? Do you have any feelings about it at all? It's no. not what you have missed here. The lives of what remains of your family. Or what? It is simplistic desire to see a clone version of the deceased offspring. I'd hardly call it simplistic. Simplistic desire. Feelings. Feelings are liabilities. It's not wrong. <laughs> he isn't? Because <laughs> that's the same kind of tripe you always hear from, like, you ooky bad guy. Hey, it's an oscillator. We, we got we got a wiggler tour. What? That the those pants have some serious rear pockets. These oh oh this is face down. I this is blood. I thought this was a belly button. I don't know. My brain's just like belly button. Oh. Also, this hand looks very much like cut out hand. Yeah, it's pretty gruesome. All right, a PDA. Yeah, it is pretty gruesome. All right. Uh, all right, I'll do the messages. Um, Sean, are you in the mood to be Pandoria Laidlaw Chambers? I can be Pandoria Laidlaw. Pandoria Laidlaw. Pandoria, Pandoria Chamber. And you I remember? The Wait, hold on. Hold on. I, got little... rogue. I forget who she was, though. She's the one who came to, like, uh, help explore the whole underground temple thing? I think so, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Mm. Alright, it's, it's my turn. It's my turn. I the message. Here we go. What I know about Mr. Cowan is what I read in the briefing. He took on several decades worth of debt with Kane to build his own rover and devoted the next five years to scouring the WOW sea for a signal. Unsurprisingly, his wife left him during this time. His search led him here. Uh, Skullwalker is different from how Dad made him sound. He seems kind. Soft, even. Not a trait I expected in a man who willingly chose to spend 70 years in stasis. Jesus. He took great interest in my work on Sumerian cuneiform. He seems genuinely disappointed when I told him how little it has yielded. I assume father told him about my transplant. He probably thought I would have achieved more. At least he was sweet and encouraging. That was a nice change. A grand staircase descends to a gong at the edge of a seemingly endless chasm. Along the steps lie the withered corpses of those who have gone before, their skin flayed and covered in ancient glyphs. Could this be the lost language of Proto-Mayan? If so, it suggests that some of the survivors managed to thrive, even after the temple sank. The gong could be part of a rudimentary machine, though a vital lever is missing. The machine was used ceremonially, and its power source may have been steam, fire, or perhaps a combination. Perhaps if I water, could find answers... Heart. 
I can find answers to these questions. It might bring my father the satisfaction he seeks. I've been sleepwalking more often. This time I awoke in the airlock. I had to have used at least two secure doors to get there. I must hurry. <laughs> my implants won't last long down here. If they deteriorate further, it won't be long before Alta returns. Oh All shit, right. is Alta like an alter ego? A uh, message to Aaron Skullwalker. Professor, I appreciate your openness, but you are mistaken. The body transplant was my father's idea. He deemed my accomplishments insufficient for a chambers, so he forced another lifetime upon me to make up the difference. Should I fail to produce results Mr. here? Mr. Body Swap is my father. Yeah. <laughs> I should have failed to produce results here. He will compel me to undergo the procedure again, regardless of my own wishes. So, thank you for your compassion. But it would be best if we proceeded on a more professional basis. It's been slow going, but I'm confident that repeating logograms indicates some biannual abyssal equinox. Perhaps the Newman may have some insight. Sacrifices were performed on key dates and accumulated at these critical times of the year when the gong would be rung. The imagery suggests the gong would summon something from below. Professor Skullwalker thinks it was their supreme deity, but I believe it's connected to the machinery photographed in Sector 5. Alright, interesting. Ouch. Sorry, go ahead, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't understand. He tries, but needs to realize who Alta is and what she's trying to do. She speaks to me often now, so my implants are all but useless. When I woke up yesterday, she held a scalpel to my neck. She wants her body back. Huh. Oh, Alta is the person that she transplanted into. And so... Alta's the original owner of the body. So, it is like Alta in there with... Uh, Professor Laidlaw, I, like, yes. holding the scalpel there. Oh, this is so interesting. I can't stay here any longer. My head feels like it's splitting in half. She won't stop till I'm dead. Please, Aaron, we both have to leave. I know about your condition you're suffering too. How long has it been since you last left? I'm begging you, let's leave this horrible place. Callan went to the drill site. He's going to try to dig a way out himself. I wanted to stop him. It's too dangerous with that creature of his roaming outside the base. He gave me that goofy grin and told me it would never hurt him. I'm sure that grin will still be on his face when his pet starts chomping. I cannot go back to the lab. Aaron is scaring me. It's painful to watch a good man lose his mind. He's afraid of the temple, so I'm safe here, at least for now. I forget who Aaron is. Who's Aaron? Whatever. You will never be safe, you will never be free. Okay, cool. That's maybe Alta? I can't stay here much longer. Aaron is calling out for me. One moment he's raging, the next desperate, terrified. He's getting closer. He knows I'm here. Oh, transcribed message. This is all you, Sean. Sweet Pandoria, I hated you before I understood what men like your father had done to you. Beat you, lashed you, left you with nothing of your own. That professor is no exception. Your affection for him is just further evidence of your profound trauma. What a sad life you've lived. How long have you wanted it to end, but lacked the strength to do it? I offer you that strength now. Do it before he does, your faithful friend. That's probably the More body like owner. Fiend. That also maybe was Alta. It's hard to tell. Some survival crafting Ancient diagrams. God, Alta Vistra. Gong mechanism. Scepter. I love, I well, love, love, that love shit. that we are getting into classic um, Atlantis shit again. Who'd have thought? Dude, it's amazing. What a wiggly, windy experience. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay, you just don't hit the space bar. She loves hitting the space bar. She loves it. It's her favorite thing to hit on the keyboard. It's right there. Body on gong. It looks like a gong. It's like a bone toe. Yeah. No, it doesn't. It looks like a bag. And whoever is strapped to it had a really bad day. Seeking all culture implies many sacrificial rituals. A primitive culture. Behind the gong, the temple continues. It is where we must go. The hammer opens the door, so oh, we have to activate it somehow. Could it perhaps be by swinging the hammer? Fire 
Yeah, that's a bagpipe, not a gong. What are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> Weird. Okay, so... <laughs> Dear God, they made him honkable. Uh, We've constructed a friend. Okay, so here, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back to Moe's, because I believe that Moe's has the oscillator, which should allow Moe's to use this on here to see the vibrate and just doesn't fucking do anything. Okay. 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 Oh my god. Did we just get a raid from the Affinity Artifacts? Is that... Is that the legendary Olivia? Baba Bing. <laughs> sure did. Hell oh. yeah. Welcome. Welcome. We're playing a game that for any of you that like gore, you're in the right place. Ooh. Oh. Also, E. coli. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Okay. So wait, 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 wait. So, so, so we've gone really deep here. Yeah. And... We have this mechanism. We don't really know how to progress this, but we do have this oscillator. This gadget detects environmental okay. variances. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe we can actually go back to Mac and we can open this mechanism here. With an oscillator? We can oscillate it? Because, I mean, this is this is literally oscillating. It's, it's oscillating. <laughs> it, that's what it's doing. You, you can't tell me that isn't oscillating. You, uh, this is, I see what the issue is. It's already oscillating, Sean. You need a de-oscillator yeah. for this one. Yeah, you're going to need an oscillator de-oscillator. I'm a huge oscillator fan. What about the live grenade? Um, sure. It, the, the, uh... Yeah, hey, welcome, everybody. I'm so sorry that you had to join us for this game. The oscillator fight was my favorite part of Metal Gear Solid 4. <laughs> So let me let me see. So if I take the saw that a blade and try to break it, <laughs> um, you know, at the zoo, I, I went to the cat exhibit and I looked at the oscillators, but they weren't there yet. So what to do? Okay, so we have what puzzles do we have that we need to solve? We need to figure out. Okay, he, here's the one that I, I think that we know, should. Man. I, I think we okay. should be able to solve this because... Oh, yeah, this weird one. Yeah, why does it turn in, like... what? Why does it alchemy itself into a different color? Like, there's nothing else in this game. I think that's... I think it's selecting it. I think it's showing you which one is, like, current. Or yeah, but has anything else in this game had a selection tint like that? IRL? Um, well, tons of stuff that was electronic. Uh, yeah, but, but it does seem like this is a different kind of thing. You're right. Maybe it's micro oxidizing to our touch. So, like, I don't understand this funk. Exactly. Non diegetic selection tint. Thank you, Glaurong64. 98% probable accuracy. Also, uh, welcome to all the raiders tonight. Um, we are in keeping with Caliban, the ancient Newman uh, oracle or whatever he is. Please append the percentage accuracy of your chat message after you type it. Okay, so wait. So, so like, maybe there's some things okay. we can combine? Or break? Um, do you have a hydrophone? Yes. Okay. I've got two turntables and a hydrophone. It's... That's all I'm going to give you for now, is hydrophone. Hydrophone. Hydrophone? What? Hydrophone? How'd your wife? That's, hey, a, that's all I'm going to give you, because literally the thing you said immediately before that was maybe we should combine some things. Okay. Here we go. Okay, it's got to be. So. Okay, hold on. All right, it's time to just brute force some shit. 
oscillator with a hydrophone? Together, these two guys should let you see sound waves. Even the tiniest really? vibrations and sounds. <laughs> I think I might be a genius. Ignoring you. Okay. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So I'm just trying to hold the I'm just trying to hold the vibe together. <laughs> Also, I hate to say it, but my soundboard is so busted. Somebody yeah. please get Discord on the call. Yeah. I also have all these sounds from Kit Fox games, and I don't even know what they sound like. Oh. But that's what I did. Last bear. That's literally yeah. what I did. No, I know, I know. The sound design there was. I don't I believe that. that. I am here for the oh. story. Oh, oh my God, is. Ames! What up, Ames? I am unsure. Damn. To the what depths of despair I would sink without you, my friend. With oh with my god, dude! Literally got back-to-back -back raids from Olivia and Ames, dude. Welcome everyone. Oh, we're playing. Wild. We're playing a game that where the developers chose to name it Stasis Bone Totem. Now, yeah, we put up a poll last week. What's the Bone Totem? Yeah. <laughs> no one was really sure. Um, <laughs> we literally have no idea. Yeah, and I think I think that it is yet to be seen. I think that we are going to get to the Bone Totem at the end. Uh, and for any of you who are actually curious what the hell I'm talking about, every Monday night, me and Lee and Sean play old and new uh, point-and-click adventure games. And today we're playing... Honestly, I think this game is unbelievable. But at this point, it just keeps escalating in insanity. So hey, stick around. So I got a torpedo key. Okay. A torpedo? A flare. Ooh, Wait. a flare. flare. Flares are good. Flares are good for operating. Um... All right, let's go to the body on the gong. <laughs> can I flare? Can I flare? Just stick a flare on I don't it? Think that's, yeah. a, that's not a gong. It's a bagpipe. <laughs> it's definitely not a gong. <laughs> it's definitely. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait. Okay. Wait. Wait. Bose. Oh, Bose has the good old torpedo key. That one was for me. That you one know, was just for me. I, I actually think that there's a new game that needs to get created. And the, the way the way the game works is that if someone has a bag, like maybe it's a laptop case or a purse or a backpack, what you do is you have each person take five items out and you rate them on a scale of one to 10 of how much of an adventure game inventory it is. Cause like right now we have a torpedo key and a key makes sense, but then we have a saw blade, beans, a flare, an open bear trap, an unconscious organic scrubber. We have a saw without a blade covered in blood. We have a live grenade. We have a dagger. We have an unconscious dagger. <laughs> well, some sort of daglar. I didn't realize that the problem with the torpedo is that I needed a torpedo key. Ah. It is bad. Oh, that, that was right. a keyhole. Looks yeah. like it has a radiation I never shield too. That. Bose, <laughs> Look at please that be careful. Ass bomb. And not okay. just for his sake. That thing goes off and takes all of us. I, I, I bet there's a death animation here, but also <laughs> I'm pretty sure the colored blue, yellow, red symbols. Yeah. Uh, we just saw those symbols in a list of four that were given numbers. Uh, and I'm guessing that that is like the order that you should put them in. Sean B, it sounds like you could definitely benefit from some Microsoft Paint because I don't know. It really sounded like you were sort of navigating me through a diagram verbally. Okay, where yeah. where I'm going. I'm going. I'm what going. are the things that we just did? Uh, where we just uh, where did we get the um, the safe? Where did we get the? Uh, yeah, it's right. It's right over here. I'm running. From. I'm having Mo's go yeah. as fast as he okay. can. Okay, cuckoo. So right those there, goes. those are the those are the symbols that are on the bomb. Okay, and so they're given numbers. Yeah, so so uh, basketball half court is one, pulsometer is okay. two, long lines is three, and uh, slashy dots is four. 
Got it. Memorized. Memorized. Yeah, good. Memorized. Bump, I have bump. so many things to organize. <laughs> Get fit with extra exercise. Okay, so. Exercise. Be careful, yeah, there's four. Sean. This is two. This is one. One. Blast. Two. Four. So I assume this is three. So let's do one. Thank God we're not colorblind. Yeah, right. There might be a uh, colorblind mode. That's true. May also just be. They may have selected the colors such that they uh, have different. Um, That's true. That's true. So we values. Put... What's what is it called? Uh, um, values. Light dark values. So, wait a minute. So this use saturation. Yeah, I think it's value. This was two. This was yeah. one. This was four. So I'm assuming that this is three, but I don't really know how to read this diagram. Does that make you an assuming Newman? I am assuming. <laughs> so wait, okay, so if this if 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 the symbol for one is on yellow, do I just keep twisting yellow? Twist it. Pop it. I think that maybe I should just do it forever. It's so like yeah. one. Two. Three. Four, you know, a little three. stick on I have five. A bump. <laughs> Good job, Lois. Good job. I have a new bomb. He's the bomb bear. Okay, so I think he what is happened the bomb bear. is that I did it, but not in a in the right. <laughs> See the reward. It's fun to play on this like a drum. Oh, oh, Despy, oh, Despy, baby. All right, go, Despy. go, go. Wait, is this it? Yes, I heard a rumor that Despy is despicable. She is. She's a little turd. Oh, turdler. All right, so I, I should hold the bomb up to. Yeah, can you just like, just so, like stick it to it? Yeah, like like I feel like it, it should be like with Apple Pay, where I can just kind of wave the nuclear bomb in front of the radiation detector, and it should let me in. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Sean, don't look now, but I'm the bits leader, baby. Oh, Lee with the hundred bitties, <laughs> Lee, fuck up. This is whatever the opposite of money laundering is. This is us oh. passing a dollar back and forth while someone yeah. quarters it. Thanks for uh, thanks for the stream, Sean. Hey, Lee, thanks for making this stream unbelievably compelling while I sit here brute forcing puzzles. <laughs> yes, that is. That is the uh, the mostly walking way. So what if I what if I send the sealed nuclear warhead to our friend? The Matt. shield from the warhead no is small, but it's lead yep. lined. <clears throat> yep. Lead Radiation sure, shield. All right. I'm just I'm Mac just... does not mind you sending a nuclear warhead through the quantum inventory. Not at like, all. Uh, nope. Like yeah, like that's Water. the definition of a conceit. Moses, right? keep going. The escape suits have to be through there. I do not like water. Are we gonna fucking Moses? We're gonna kill Moses. I do not like water. I will Moses not go into the water. Is a hundred percent built for a heroic sacrifice. At which point I will rage quit. Yeah, no. Yeah. Like if internet. if Mose yeah. dies, so does the chance of us finishing this game. Yep. <sighs> yep. Warhead. It's so warm. Um. Why did they build a bear who can have trauma? So is there, I see a, I see a pump here. Maybe we need to like pump the water out or something. Pump a dump. Okay. So that goes underneath, but what about over here? Was this where there were the pump stuff? Is this where there were the pump? Oh my god, that was Bilbo voice. 
I just realized that was a voice that I've been doing mm. my whole life from the 1970s Hobbit, where he's like, mm. is this the adventure you'd plan for me? <laughs> so, burgle something. I don't Some think there's anything else down you are. underneath. So there, there's the... Oh, th there's this altar. But what's this altar about? It's got... It's got a scale on it. Figure out, <laughs> we can figure out how much a nuclear bomb weighs for sure. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So chat, if can you want to, you can use your uh, use your stream points to redeem. Uh, and and I'll do, I'll read something in the voice of any of the characters from the 1970s uh, Hobbit. Just uh, redeem 75,000 channel oh, points. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> Lee, Lee is going to create a temporary. Fictional economy. It's like standing outside of a phone store and being like, if you give me $400, I'll give you a uh, ringtone. I mean, somebody did once pitch me on the idea of just having my own checkout line at like a Best Buy. <laughs> Wait, like a, like a, like a pirate checkout line? Just like a... Yeah. Yeah, yeah you just ring them up. <laughs> no, this, this, no, this is, there, there's actually a... There's actually a terrible business idea here where there's actually a warehouse and you can go in and just set up your own cash register and then yeah. anything that people buy and go through your cash register, you get a small cut of right. so much as paying for the inventory. You're just you're just choosing right. what to operate. So like they can go to you with like a with like a bag of Twinkies and you can be like, "Oh, I don't sell this at this register." You don't need to go to that register. Like you can choose in the in the warehouse what you sell. It's amazing. That is. Amazing. I feel That's like <laughs> legitimately Lee, knowing Best Buy. Legitimately, yeah. Legit, legitimately, uh, knowing Best Buy, if you could somehow manage to get like the day manager out of the store, yeah. nobody would stop you from just open, yeah. like standing at a register and making cash transactions <laughs> or like scanning scanning people's cards with a square on your phone yeah and being like all right there you go i think anybody who does cash transactions at this point the cashier should just keep a hundred percent of that yeah is that wrong that's, that's what I i'm think saying that's right so legitimately we're gonna march all day, all day, all day. Is that the? Oh, you Where did you create the lever? A... Yeah, I just I just stuck right, the skull in right, there, man. Right. You just ah. stuck a skull in there. Okay, look. And so now, the lever that was missing is no longer missing. Here's my analysis. This is filled with water, and yeah, so okay. shiny there, water. Uh, there's no water. Amount. Yeah, shiny water, like oil or something, something flammable. No, oil and water don't mix, John. Well, oh, is there I love saying there? something technically true that just makes the conversation worse. You know, <laughs> just like throwing in a fact. Yes, that fucking like, burn it off. Yes. Not Germain. Yes. Yeah, so Stick a fuel. flare in the torpedo and then huck the torpedo into the oil. Okay, so let me. So here's here's kind of what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that like because on this screen there's literally nothing interactable. Here. There's nothing to click on, because otherwise I could hit my magical right-click button and things would glow. And so, right. I think we need to either drain the water or do something somewhere else. And I'm like, all right, well, Mac is trying to get into this door and can't get in. So the door, Paul clamp. What's a Paul clamp? Paul. So we need some kind of clamp thing, maybe an open bear trap. Okay. I can reset weed now. <laughs> Smart Mac. Depends yeah. on what's behind it. So dumb. I read the words and the word was clamp, and few things clamp as hard as a fucking bear trap. Hell yeah. Amazing. <laughs> this is what my brain feels like when I haven't had coffee. Yeah. <laughs> the grinding wheel dislodged. Got to disconnect the main wheel from the milling stone. Somehow. Go ahead, man. Just fucking don't mind me. I'm the player. You just do what,
Tension from the wheels got it wedged. Only way maybe would be to cut. Oh, it. I'd have to Prince of Persia this thing. No, 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 no. Go, go, go back, go back, go back. So, God, they've discovered channel points. I don't understand. What? Where is the piece of wood that's jammed in there? I have no idea. But I know here's the interactable. That's You're doing so much with that sound design. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, okay, so first things first. We're gonna ask if we can break anything. It looks like the answer is no. Can't break anything open. All right, so let me just use every object that we have. I'm pretty sure we need to construct something. Sean, Sean. It's, it's a nightmare. Sean. It's a nightmare. You didn't, you don't have any, your economy is totally broken. You don't have any drains, Sean. All they can do is highlight the message. <laughs> I know, I know, they I know. Channel spend. points are such like a. They can't spend, Sean. You need to do ASMR. You need to do 30,000 points for a trigger word. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, let's play another episode of Bone Totem. <laughs> okay, so, so wait, wait, I, I feel like. The situation that we're in, and I'm pretty sure this is it, is that, like, we need to fix this, and that's, like, the problem. And so we need to do some sort of cutting. But this... For more strenuous tasks, but it will cut. Okay, so maybe I use it to open the can of beans. Maybe I use the knife to open a can of beans. Or maybe I use yeah. the radiation shield to open a can of beans. Dude, I swear to God, I'm just gonna, I'm going to start combining every single pair of items. Please. Oh, a saw without a blade? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Watch this, and then I'm gonna put this on. <laughs> what did she do? Wait, what happened? What happened? <laughs> what both sides? You made a saw, the blade, and then I said we need a mod, and then Just Nine Thousand said, "Yeah, I'm the mod. Look what you did, you goblin." <laughs> Go ahead, uh, mod. Cancel all I'm, of their redeems. No, I dare I'm, you. All right. Refund Fucking, them all. Uh, delighted that you had up. in your inventory a a blade that you can carry oh, yeah. and a saw without a blade. Now get out of there. Also, Fast that's not how can. you fix a water wheel. No. What are you doing? I don't Sean? understand what just happened. So. We had a saw without a blade, and then we had a blade without a saw, and we combined them together. Yeah, that's. And I don't know why. In the night. That was good. You need to make more meat tools, I think. Whoa! Apple Vision Pro. <laughs> <laughs> so do I. <laughs> what? 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 What do I? What now? What do we do? What do I do? What? I thought I did it. I thought I nailed it. I thought I was like the best. The best there ever was. Simply the best. Like. What? What? Um. This is sometimes the problem is that like these, these people say stuff. Wait, can I like look at the history of messages? Look at that saucy lady over there, leaning against oh. that old doorway. Look at that. She's wearing uh, tomboy X's. <laughs> Wait, so do I, do I go to high ground? Got me undies is this, on. this what we do? You've got the high ground now, dog. What? Where's the battery charger? <laughs> we already use that though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We use this charge battery. Um, yeah. We okay. Um, all right, I, I'm here for the the Sean Bouchard hint line. I, so Charlie, sh we need to get Charlie into a clay oil tank. I don't even know what that would look like. Clay oil tank. What does that mean? What? What other? What? 
I can imagine several configurations of a clay oil tank. But I don't know. You know, they're all so very different. So, oh, sure, there you go. Tarot cards. <coughs> oh, God. I'm gonna, I feel like I'm going to wander all the way back. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me look. Let me look. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get the hint line going. Da -da 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 -da. Oil tank. Oil tank. Okay, all right. Um. This is, uh, we gotta solve the calendar puzzle. I forgot that existed. Okay, no, no, okay, we, we, we can stop now. Yeah. There's this calendar puzzle that I just literally totally forgot it existed. Um, I'm okay. right. So, uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, inspect the body on the gong, press the air bladder, and note the sound that it makes. I hate that. So much. I hate that so much. I believe much it was it, a, it was an aim it was a, it was a, an A sharp. Wait. A sharp doesn't even exist. Okay, so you're talking about a B flat. Mm. What? Oh! Okay. 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 Um return to the calendar and place the star disc in the center. Do we have a star disc? You and want Charlotte me to do garlic, what? Love you too. What kind of object? Uh, I don't recall the star disc. Let's see. I think you just okay. need to take two things right. from the inventory. You one wet and one dry Here's and put them together. Up, Sean. Here's what you fucked up. All right. At each tattoo, turn the skull from facing inwards to facing outward. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't think I you did that. I, I'm pretty <laughs> sure I did that for all the ones that I... Well, I tried to do it for all the ones, and I thought I did it for all the ones. However... It could be that I just missed one. Okay. On the third one, there's something different or something. Scullular technology. Whoa! There we go. Oh, okay. So we had to come back after you turned all the skulls. I see. Fucking, fucking fuck. This game is... Like a hard left turn into Rudimentary technology. I don't like the look of that thing. They shine like stars. Okay, so so I feel like th this is the kind of puzzle design that like oh, oh that just kills me. This is the kind of puzzle design where we went here and I, I actually think that there is a UI UX misleading thing. So for those of you that can't actually see my mouse hand at the moment, and the one stalker who can, hi. Um, if I left click, I move around. And if I right click, it shows me what's interactable. The green dots are what I can look at. The blue dots are what I can actually interact with. And whenever I'm on a uh, some scene, it will show me what can and can't be interacted with. So for instance, right here, if I right click, nothing shows, which means there's nothing more interactable. And so when, when I was here, I didn't, I right clicked it. I don't think I saw anything interactable. No, there was, there's not anything interactable there. I, and I, I, um, I don't know if this is true, but I think that when I first looked at it, there was nothing interactable. And what that does for me is it makes my brain go, aha, I am done here. <laughs> okay. So I will say that while you were, were doing that, when you got to that one that had the hands, and two of them wow. were like up the and three of them were down. Yeah. Amazing. I thought, I wonder if that's the related to age. the skulls. Like, yeah. you said I wonder if this that's controlling how many of the calendar? hands were down or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, it, and, and I definitely think <laughs> that it's one of those things where some percentage of people will get that. Sure. And. The, the for me it's not that you, oh i didn't get it at first and if i kept working maybe i would have gotten it because for instance let's say there's this puzzle where there's clearly things that i can interact with I can, like, <laughs> rotate things I can... whoa was that an elephant sound that's crazy sound but like that is crazy that is so weird it, like it's wait try clear. that again i heard like i hear a really weird sound can you try it one more time well, 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 before I do that, like, the, okay. like these are clearly interactable. And so, like, if I struggle with this puzzle a little bit, 
and I don't solve it, yeah. I'm going to remember that there, there were interactable things here and I really want to come back here. But the problem that I have with the way that that previous puzzle was designed of like turn around all the skulls and then go back is that for someone like me that just didn't understand that there was a connection, my brain there went- There was something important there. Yeah, my brain went, oh, no interactables. I'm never going to come back here again. And so like, right. it, it, and I feel like that, it's like a small UX lie that gets communicated in there for, for mm. some small percentage of players. So I'm ready, are you, Lee, are you ready for the noise? Yeah, can you just try one? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> That is so weird, right? Rudimentary I, I air I... horn primitive technology. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, th this is the sound. This is the game. <laughs> that dude from Police Academy is trapped in there. What is, what is bogus? I don't understand what is happening when I do this. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's this one. <laughs> Wait, okay. hold on, hold what on, I hold do... on. No, 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 go back to it, go back to it. Yeah, yeah. What I do love is that this screen could be from Nancy Drew or it could be from like like any number of games we've played. Uh, okay, so I know what the solution is, but I don't understand why it's the solution. Yeah. So, interact with this a little bit more, and let me see if I can wrap my head around what's going on. You click that, it spins a thing, it makes a noise. Yeah, and that's very similar to the noise of the organ heart down on the gong. It is. Oh, is it? Okay, so then if you press the center... Is that... Is that different than other times when you press the center? If you go to a different don't, place. Don't listen for it. No. It's longer. Right? That's like a very quick thing. Oh, I see. Yeah. That's more of a like it's a it's a slightly like different response. So both of those work. Are you away from match? Instrument. 69% accuracy. Oh, so I have to do it in that order. So this is... I, I'm 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 gonna go back to the gong and listen to it, even though it's fucking okay. a million miles away. Because the name of the show is mostly okay. walking, and that's why we must embody the title of the show. Since the game has a soundboard in it, I'm gonna put away my soundboard. I do like the one that's just like. Okay, okay. Let's go soundboarding. Oh, it's, it's, woo! Okay. Yes, yes. So there's actually the three noises. I didn't understand that first. Yes. I understand now that the gong is beneath him. It's not. The gong is not the instrument. The instrument is, in fact, the bagpipes. The instrument is, the in fact, what? The bagpipe. The bagpipes. The, the gong is being concealed by the bagpipes. No, the gong... The man is on the gong. And the bagpipes are in the man. <laughs> so, it, it seems like there's only three noises on the disc. I think. I think... Yeah, that might be true. The compact disc. <laughs> that one, that's my favorite. Okay, so I think it's I think it's this bottom one. Okay, 
so here, here we go. We're gonna do this one first. Fuck this game. <laughs> it yeah, didn't this game work. Sucks so much, but all right. <clears throat> Press the hand to move the outer track of the disc so that the hand is pointing to the sun. And why is the Amogus so cute? Like, what the fuck? I don't know. It's so cute. It's so cute. All right. Press the center of the disc, then press the hand three more times, one for each note, and then press the disc center again. Then press the disc center once for each hour so and twice for each it was like It was like you press it once to start recording and then... Have it make it play the sound and then press it again to like that. That I, that didn't make any sense. I do. I think that there is a problem here where some of these puzzles are good, but there is a like puzzle exhaustion at yeah. this point in the game. And like it's some of these puzzles, if they had been earlier in the game and maybe a little bit more refined, would have worked totally well. But we've seen so many puzzles at this point. They're like, they have to come up with more puzzle content uh, and the quality is dropping. Well, yeah, and I, I, I don't think there's anything that I that is wrong with just repetition. <laughs> like, oh, I see, it's kind of like that other puzzle. Okay, cool, got sure. it, nice, yeah. I mean, no, there's a reason I why agree. I, there's a reason why I keep playing these fucking games, man. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I'm getting this exhaustion from everything else about the game. Smells like oil. That's your flame source. Assuming our new AI overlord knows what it's talking about. 100% accuracy prediction. <laughs> <laughs> okay, when this game has a sense of humor, it's got a good sense of humor. Alright, I'm a flare bear. Screen flashed over here. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. Whatever this is, though. it's really flammable. The heat coming off it is intense. Rudimentary technology. Primitive culture. Big power source. Super embarrassing. <sighs> That's totally what I'm scuffed. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking embarrassing. <laughs> Humiliation. Um <laughs> Hey, that's don't don't eat that. Don't eat don't eat that. Hey, stop. You don't know fucking eat it. I don't, I don't give a shit. Alright, yeah. so it all comes through. That this too will pass. <laughs> Oh, this is sweet. Hey, look at that rudimentary lighting. Oh my god, how primitive. So primitive. Oh no, you're gonna have to wall Holy wall. shit, the whole place looks like it's burning. <laughs> Holy Language fuck, you're right. <laughs> Holy I fucking this whole place fuck, burning man. Was what you wanted. Not with you in it. This so let me time. let me put on a radiation shield as like a it's like a boot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I literally, I just go across it. There's no puzzle. I just go across yeah, it. Yeah, you just run through coals. Copy that. Just do Dude, it. it means I bet nothing. if you stopped in the middle, though. You know, now that there's light, I can really see how talented their artistry is. It's so dark. Yeah, that's right. I oh. love the uh, sense of um, go get it that that one column has. It started yeah. everything spinning. Sure. Fire? Spinning? How did I do that? <laughs> You act like you're superior to everything here, but you're just as trapped as I am. Just, you're just as helpless. As snatched as I am. <laughs> oh, brutal! We're all trapped here now, thanks to you. Can you not oh, even begin <gasps> to understand? You heard her too. That wasn't her. Who wasn't are you thing. trying to? Are you? Literally you, dude. Hope. Yeah, literally you. Alive. Hey! Keep hope alive. Look, Should have called I just want to continue building our fun little skullhead man friend, okay? Yeah, no, he's, he's about to give us the <laughs> nod of encouragement. Check it out. Yep. Yes! Oh, <laughs> absolutely gone. <laughs> okay. Okay. I was not expecting. I don't like the looks of this. Now I wish I had leaned more Indeed. into my map, Barry. Yes. My knowledge of this place ends here. 
You are about to enter a part of the temple no one has ever explored before. It is How can impossible anyone know to that? predict what you will find beyond. Well, I don't see it. Remember, any other the choice. scientists were faced with the same this puzzle we were, and they didn't have hints, so. We'll find each other. <laughs> the only way out now is through. We are all we've got left. We have always have always been what we've got. Yeah. We've always we've always been all we've got left. It hasn't never not been the case that we're all we've not got left. 83% pit not, accuracy. Pit not gone. Chapter oh, 4. God damn it. I, Son of a I'm expecting it to say end tutorial. Oh, we're all we've got <laughs> left, Lee. We're all we've got. <laughs> we're all we've got. Who's all? Yavuzo. Yavuzo. All right, everyone, we're halfway done. You and done. me are the only me that you've always got left. The door. The door sealed behind me. Thank God. <gasps> Not going God. back that way. Oh my God. Where are you? <sighs> Looks like a, the right. Well, a crypt. Uh, like Veron said. Some and kind I of think there's sarcophagus in the else. middle of the room, too. Big one. Yeah. Not unsettling at all. Fuck. Nice. Sarcasm. What? Look, I'm gonna fix my desk, okay? As long as this game is going. Okay, so like... This, th this as a puzzle makes sense to me because I rotate it and I, I, I feel a, like a large jostle and a jiggle. So like maybe something else is connected to this. And I'm like, cool, I'll I do not like this. I'm with the bear, disturbing the dead. Never a good thing. Anyway, I feel like the dead are disturbing me. Why? What's in there? Trust me, 82 is like ritualistic symbolism. It's used for That's my favorite uh, prog rock ball. band. We should get we should get Caliban to be a co-host on the show. Oh, I'm sure we can make a Caliban. Go back and try using the wrench on the shopkeeper's door. Primitive, unremarkable puzzle. Oh, oh don't drink the juice. You know. Oh yes, breathe it in. Oh, yeah. What the fuck? Is that nose hairs? It is. Great. This is wonderful. I love this. I love what's happening here. Oh! Ah! 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 No! This is worse than the new... Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to invent a new content warning. Charlie? I don't like any of this. Nobody likes any of this. Warning and sterilization protocols immediately. Be careful out there, Star Fox. Ugh. Charlie! Okay. <coughs> I'm okay. I don't think so. I don't need what is inside. Do you know what you just exposed her to? She came down here, risked everything for you, and she... The most chances of survival are about 50%. A necessary risk margin. Ten. Get this man a fedora. What do you mean, necessary? <coughs> Mac? I swear to Kane. Please give our copy I pasta daughter my me. love! Kane has no power here. Only I do. I am her only oh, chance of survival now. Oh my god, he's taking existed. control of the situation. <coughs> 57. Seriously, 56. I'm not fucking <laughs> around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got a death mask. But what about okay. that cute little necklace that he's wearing? I think we just need to remember that. It's a real, real happy square guy. Spirit door. A spirit door. In this primitive belief system, behind it is <laughs> pathway to this time of the year, located spirit directly in your kitchen. Charlie. <laughs> I can't, sweetheart. I can't. <laughs> Uh, this this actually you know, reminds Sean. me of the posture of all of our viewers at home. Uh, yeah, Sean. Or at least, yeah. <laughs> With the power of OBS, there's a lot of characters in these games that could become a fourth host. Ooh, that's that's true. 
Can it you is just, true. You can't just look at that. That was easy. I, I, you know, I'm loving the uh, art direction on these skulls. <laughs> what is... What did I inhale? My Charlie. Uh, I think I oh. inhaled... Can you change all three? Uh, <laughs> How is that happening? Dude, look, what is... <laughs> this one is my favorite. That... <laughs> they just decided to make this monkey island at this point. Uh -huh, uh -huh, this, uh -huh. is, this is when you upload I your photo feel to like Steam. I shouldn't be here. And it's just a little too large. <laughs> Clock. Stop well, five. Something about this cave is making me uneasy. So, I mean, I think we're looking for. Because we can be like red. Okay, so this guy has steam, to be here. Steam out the ears guy. Yeah, steam out the ears guy. We saw. We saw steam out the ears guy. He's Steam actually out the ears Yeah, Steam Out the Ears guy. Look, let me show you. Here he is. Steam Out the Ears guy. Sorry, I'm not Do you think he's first? Or middle? I'm gonna say first. In my desk. You can tell me about it though. Yeah, I, I think so. So, Steam Out the Ears. Yellow three eyes and green Zizz. beetles. Zizz. Is that guy? Because he's got a zizz on his forehead. Oh. See me at the ears, guy. You know, Sean. Sometimes I think you're just trying to stop me from finding the secret. The secret of monkey. Or maybe that's not it. Yeah. What if? He's in the middle. Stuck in the middle with you. Is it every time we are here? Is it in a different arrangement? I think this is not anywhere, right? Why are you solving pirate? I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say we do red, steam out the ears, and then scissors. All right. Oh. Oh no! I think... This is the co this is the copy protection. You just have to use the uh, pirate. Yeah, you have to use the manual. Yeah, you go to. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, because I think it's you go from flesh into death, and then you're reborn as a weird, monstrous thing. <laughs> I, that's what I think. I okay. Think, I think this is the game. Water animal forever. Fuck you. And I don't know what it is I should do. Oh, ZZ. I see. Um, ZZ. All right. So... Okay. What do you think my the bottom symbol even is? Rotate the clock hands until the thickest hand points to the symbol on the sarcophagus <laughs> occupant's chest. That's what we did. That's that. That's right there. Okay. Grasp the thickest hand. The other two symbols point to the red skull and yellow three-eyed face. Okay. Yeah. Seems clear enough. Um, Using your forefinger... Okay, so we did it exactly right, except that we have to start with the steam out the ears on top. And then I have no idea where the other two should go because that doesn't make any sense. Why, why would that possibly be? I don't know. And then red. What the fuck? Cut. Why? I don't understand. Why? Why would it be that? Got it. 
Charlie, how do you feel? That was a bad puzzle. <sighs> yeah. Not good. Yeah. <laughs> Move with haste and accuracy, Sean. Please. Caliban, what did you mean before? When you said she had better than 50% chance of surviving. What do you think you meant? Exactly. Why a 50% chance? I can tell chance. it to you, but I can't hear it for What you. did she inhale? <laughs> the Velis. <laughs> I'm afraid. Oh, no. No. Charlie. Wait. Oh, wait, what? I am very sorry, Charlie. But I can think of nothing else your plug suit detectors would label a volatile contaminant in this environment. My Charlie. Really? That plant-based stuff we've been seeing in the body since we got here? She's infected with it? Accuracy prediction, 100%. Oh, we got oh. there. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. <laughs> uh, how fast can it spread? Uh, I mean, she was just exposed to it. Its maturation period is within hours. If she does not reach the surface very quickly... Is this what happened to, uh... Okay. Ferran? Okay. Further hesitation only decreases her odds of survival. And yours, you son of a bitch. Accuracy prediction, 100%. I feel like Charlie has been filled with all the parasites at this point. Yep. There's gonna be like another thing on the radio that's like, Hello, I am the alien plant. <laughs> Come on. The organs are removed and carefully weighed to determine the deceased's fate after life. Once balance was achieved, spirits will ascend. How do you know that? Baran said no one's explored this area. Baran was a fool. Analysis of primitive cultures of similar geographic regions. 91% accuracy. <coughs> okay, okay, chat, STD. Keep going. <laughs> That's pretty good, Lee. I like that one. Thank you. Yeah, I thought that was a goodie. <coughs> um. Oh, I look. It's, okay. Yeah, I mean. It's, it's 8.50, so can I tell you guys the thing that is, like, driving me absolutely insane? Yeah. Um. That's our show, everyone. Have a great night. Uh, <laughs> I mean, sorry, no, this sorry, will just please, take a please. second. This is no, just going to take a second. Absolutely. But it might inspire further conversation. I don't know. The walkthrough that I'm looking at is broken up into 12 chapters, seemingly arbitrarily. I can't tell what relationship these 12 yeah. chapters have to anything that's going on in the game. Wait, 12 chapters? Yeah. But the 12 chapters are named... Bone Totem 1, Bone Totem 2, Bone Totem 3, <laughs> Bone Totem 4. It's what? it's suggestive Wait. that we are somewhere around 10 Bone Totems out of a total of 12 Bone Totems. What? And I can't for the life of me figure out what the fuck a Bone Totem is. What's a Bone like, Totem? 6.5 out of what? 10 Bone Totems. I... I mean, we did say that there were many things that could be bone totems in this game. Maybe we should have been saying and instead of or. But then again, it's not called stasis bone totems. Yeah, it's, it's called not. bone totem. Um, what? Bo bone totem, all of the chapters are named bone to totem number something. What? Uh, and the, the term bone totem is not mentioned anywhere else in the walkthrough. They had but it sounds like your chapters and your bone totems do not correspond at all to our chapter four. Is that correct? No, no, unrelated to well, chapter four. Are those bone totems? No, those are viscera jars. Whoa! Oops. It's a corpse screw. Oh, fuck, man. <laughs> Somnambulist, rest. Somnambulist Rex says the real bone totems are the friends we made along the way. I agree with that. <laughs> we made ten friends. Okay, so... Are we supposed to compare these? 
for the sake of making this mechanism balance. Clone totem if you got him. <clears throat> or, or, or is it like... Oh, ah. I see this. This informs us. And this Rudimentary doesn't... amiibos. All right, so let's let's do it like this. Let's just compare. All right, so blue is heavier than yellow, and if I move yellow here, blue is still heavier. And if I move yellow over here, I think maybe it is not. Uh... <laughs> Positionally dependent. That's what I'm thinking. All right, so, so this is heavier. Green is heavier than blue. Is green heavier than blue plus yellow? I do love that it does a little like, mm, I don't know, shrug every time you hit the button. It's so coy. Let's have this guy break some of this shit open, huh? Don't start, Sheriff. I feel like the positions have to matter, right? Otherwise, it doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> I mean, they didn't in the... Uh, well, there could be more targets. They did the sister title of Puppet Man. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Good old Puppet Yo, Man. Did you just launch your cat? What did you do? Okay, so let's 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 do this again. So here's this is heavier than nothing. So now these are heavy. Okay. So let let, let me move, move this green over here. Could it be the order of yellow and blue? Yeah. Let's let's find out. I don't remember what the original order was. That's blue, yellow. Here's yellow, blue. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> what if you switch the sides? <coughs> oh. Huh. I'm just gonna double check that none of these other things can go in here. Oh my fucking fuck. I know how to solve it. We weigh them. We literally weigh them. We go to the scale. Weigh them. Weigh go them. back to the scale. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a Chekhov's scale. If you see a scale in a game, you're gonna have to weigh something. So this is 16. Oh! <gasps> So green is 12, blue is 8, 4. This is 16, this is 12, and this is 4. So it's beans, beans, green, and yellow. Beans, green, and yellow, baby. Okay, beans, green, yellow. I mean, may, you know what? Maybe, maybe. But but we figured out that the sides change it, right? Like, it's not it's not a perfect scale. Well, let me. I, I gotta go back to this. Let, let me There's just make sure. Weird I'm not about crazy. this scale. There's a few things that are weird about this scale, Sean. Oh, you mean the Sheriff. scale? Okay, let me, let's let's do this again. 
Blue is eight in the middle. Yellow is light as a feather. Blue's in the middle. Green is 12. So it's four, eight, 12, and 16. So is it four and eight and 16? Or do we four, actually need- 16 and four. Yeah, I mean, I haven't tried four of them yet because I mean, th th this is, I, I think, a bit of a problem with the um, certain logic is like, it was like, it has to be balanced. Now, what we could do is we could put this 16 here, yellow is light as a feather, and we put these two over here. So we did need to use all of them. Okay, I was just, there was, there's multiple ways to make- but Why, design. why would that, why would that work? But not 12 plus eight plus four, which also works. No. Right. Bodies would drop into the hole. This would be out of sight of the people. They rose. They would believe they had risen. A primitive culture. Like Cain Dude. is any different. It's not the same thing. The Nexus is real. Based on what collation? Based on what evidence? My loyalty to my creators has waned. Would you like to know more? Like to know the truth? He's about to drop the 100% attack. After all, the human shepherded. I can't tell you its truths, its realities. What I cannot tell you is if you will like the answers I provide. No. I like my beliefs just as they are. I predicted as much. 99%. All right, who's ready to drop into the pit? All right, we're gonna end right there. <laughs> All right, and we did it. We made it through another. Uh, another I can't session. believe it's still going. Okay, so like, this it's th this is the adventure game problem. The adventure game problem is the first half is ten out of ten, and like, I mean, r regardless of how this game ends, this is still like, one of the most spectacular games I've ever played. But in terms of some of these puzzles. Like that last puzzle was objectively goofing. It was goofing because <laughs> you you have you have four and eight and twelve and sixteen. So you can do twelve and eight and four. That yeah. works. Seems like. And you can also do sixteen four twelve eight, which is what we did. Yep. And maybe it all, it needed two on each side, so it's equal in all ways and doesn't. But there's care three that holes, so there's no reason to think that like I wouldn't need. To fill two out of three of the holes on each side. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. And then, like, the previous puzzle where it's like, there's a clock and it will point at three things, and the one in the middle is actually the one on the top. Like, I don't, I literally don't get it. Or the thing where, like, you have to match the three sounds that you hear, but you don't press the button on those three sounds, you press the button before and after the three sounds. Like, what, like, where does that come from? And the thing is, I actually don't <clears throat> mind puzzles like that when there is some UI UX. Like for instance, if we hit a button and like something lit up blue and then we rotate it around, we hit it again and then something lit up yellow and then it like traced a blue to yellow line and was playing sounds along it. And I'd be like, oh, I think mm -hmm. it's recording something. Ah, you know, like you can, mm -hmm. there's things that you can piece together, but like, the last four puzzles that we've done, after you have described the solution and I've hit the button, I have been even more confused. Which I do think, so I don't know, we talk about it as, uh, oh my God, we're in the last half of the game and we've run out of money. And so we're just kind of like throwing stuff together. I do think that there's an element of like, when you are play testing this game, when you're doing QA on this game, you're gonna prioritize the stuff in the beginning, right? Cause that's the mm -hmm. stuff that most of your players are gonna play. That's the stuff that is potentially gonna make a sale. Yeah. Um, and that's also the stuff that it's easiest to get play tests for. Yeah. Right? Cause uh, to play test the last half of the game, you have to have somebody play through the first half of the game first. So I, I, I imagine that like all of the puzzles were closer to this quality at one point 
Yeah. But the the ones in the beginning of the game ended up getting refined, getting sort of like UX added to them, usability taken into account. Uh, we we saw some puzzles early on that were very similar to these sorts of puzzles, but there were multiple solutions that worked. Yeah. Um, and I thought that was really interesting at the time. Uh, and I think that that is, hey, we play tested this and people are getting it wrong for a totally reasonable reason. We need to make those answers also correct or else people are going to get stuck at this puzzle. And that kind of play testing analysis and, uh, and effort and development that they just, they yeah. couldn't do it in the second half. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, I want to piggyback on something you said, which is, I think we will always refer to it as the ran out of money problem because probably the first 20 games that we played were old Sierra and LucasArts games where in their development history, they were like, yeah, we ran out of money, so we just fucking rushed yeah. the second half. Yes, that's true. <laughs> where, you know, where, where there's actual, like, stories of, like, yeah, you know, we, we did a lot of testing at the start, and uh, things got really tight, and we just we just banged it out, and there it is, it's done. Um, yeah, and I, I think yeah, there's I something... Mean, I'm also... Oh, go ahead, Lee. I was wondering if, uh, if we are perhaps erroneous when we think that they make the game start to finish. I wonder if sometimes maybe it's not as good later because they figured out what they're doing. Maybe they worked on some of the later stuff first sure, and sure. then figured out what they were doing. I don't know. Yeah, because But I it think... is Oh. It is always that kind of long like once the game starts feeling really long, that's when it gets to that that old familiar kind of oof you know yeah the feeling oof ow my bone totem <laughs> oof ouch um, my bone totem yeah yeah and, and and i will know i think that there there is a type of critique that actually is honestly kind of fucking useless which is here is what i am going to state is the reason why this puzzle didn't turn out great because i don't fucking know like it it, it it sometimes is as simple as oh, i like that puzzle <laughs> you know like you know Sure. And uh, yeah, no, a, lot, a lot of people uh, hated that. A lot of people liked it. So you know, I don't kept it that way. Um, th there's a lot of different reasons, and I think that the reasons why that occurred are only interesting in so much as piecing these kinds of things together can be helpful to understand on my own future project. When I say that that's the royal my or like your own future project, like like what what what's something that 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 could potentially go awry, but like. There's a simple observation that the last three or four puzzles were just unbelievably bafflingly confusing, especially once once solved. I was the most confused of all. I was like, why? Why is that the way it is? Yeah. 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 I, I mean, I'm never here for the puzzles, honestly. I'm here for everything else. I love a good puzzle, just not when I'm on stream. That's why I never <laughs> do the puzzles. You'll notice that. Puzzles are for Sean's. I'm here to keep the peace between <laughs> us and the... Uh, and the viewers at home. Fucking art direction. It's the viewers at home. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the joke master general. I'm the goof police. I I do... I want to sort of run this by you both as well. There's still plenty of gore in this game, but I feel yeah. like the, the sort of, like, shock... Uh, I don't know, beats or scenes or images have like died way down compared to the beginning of the game. Is that is that right or have I just become yeah. sensitized to it? I mean, I think there's a pacing in this game where they try to show us a showstopper, super gross, you know, pile of legs or whatever the hell every once in a while. Mm -hmm. And I feel like they've missed a couple beats on that. Like we just haven't seen that uh, lately. Usually a room scale icky mess. Um, we haven't seen one of those in a while now. I bet. I bet. Yeah. We, I think we're due for one. I think we're overdue yeah. oh. for one. Sorry, oh, cat. Be a better <laughs> gamer. Mixer. Hey, be a better gamer. <laughs> cat. cat says. Despy says. Be a better gamer. Cat says. Okay. Bye bye. Uh. Well. Yeah. No. I think. I, I'm excited to play another week, and maybe another week as well, and maybe another week as well, maybe another week as well. Um, we're going to play this game forever because, in fact, ChatGPT and Dolly are currently generating the text and images of each screen 
so that every week with 99 you can just keep. Because I bet you were going to jump into this pit, and she's going to land on a platform in the middle of an undersea ocean that has an elevator going down inside of that. <laughs> or going to go all the way down, and there's going to be another lab. Like, it's just going to be combinatorially nonsense. It's going to be great. And then inside that, inside that, against all probability, GeoCities. Once you get in there, yeah. it's, geez, it's fucking weird, right? That's where it is. That's where you, it ended up. You do not want to know what happened to the burning dog and the man who tried to pet it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go because, like, I can feel yeah, my body is ready to go to bed. And uh, let me see if I can yeah. get one one shout out right. from Despy. Hey, let me get, let me put some energy into the cat. Hey, Despy. I feel like for a while. All right, cool. We're going to bed. Good night, everyone. Good. G. 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 G.